Hi, I'm Lane Kritzer from Curtis Blue Line. And I'm here to talk to you today about Avon air purifying respirators, also known as APRs. I'm going to start out with the FM53 and the features that may work for you in your mission profile. Starting at the very top, we have a wide panoramic view lens. And you'll notice it has a very low profile, which makes it very easy to interface if you use night vision with gas mask. Going down past the nose piece and getting right here, we're gonna look at what's called the VPU2 or voice projection unit. This is a digital model, which is designed to work with both the FM53 and the FM54, which you'll see in the future. On the end of the FM53, you'll notice here's the off switch and the on switch to turn it on. And you'll notice there's no illumination, like a little red LED. So this works really well for tactical teams without having any type of light pollution. It is removable by just depressing this little button and then reinstalling it back in by clicking into place. On the front of the voice projection unit, right here and off to the left, you'll notice, I'll remove the voice projection unit to make it a little bit easier to see, is you're gonna notice this lever right here, which allows me to control whether I'm running in a negative pressure. Negative pressure means I'm pulling air in through the purifying filter, or I can connect a positive air pressure system or a SCBA, self-contained breathing apparatus system, and I can rotate that lever down into the positive position to allow that positive air flowing in there. So it's very adaptable for multiple mission capabilities. Again, I take that lever, move it back up into the negative position to run the air purifying respirator. Let me reinstall the VPU, put that into place. One other thing to notice is that this entire system is NIOSH certified, which means with the VPU connected and the filters attached, it does have the NIOSH certification. You'll actually see that listed on the interior of the filters. The voice projection unit plugs in to a port on the bottom of the FM53, and you'll see it has a, a proprietary three-prong connection, which allows you to plug that in to connect with the microphone assembly on the interior. You'll see that in a moment. I also wanna point out on the exterior section of the connector, you'll see a two-prong connector, which allows you to plug in other communications devices, such as Tactical Command Industries or Invisio um, communication systems. On the right hand side, you'll see right here is a removable hydration connection. This will connect to canteens and camelback type hydration bladders. And on the other side, you'll see right here is a lever which allows you to rotate it outboard to put the straw into drinking mode and then stow it out of the way. I'll show you on the interior here in a moment also. On either side of the Avon APRs, you can get these in either a single port or a dual port. I happen to have the dual port version here. You'll see there's a port on the right side with that removable plug. And on the left side, I can remove the filter and you'll see that it has the NATO 40 millimeter threads to allow you to be able to put the filter inside. The advantage to having the filter on the left side or the right side, this allows you to be able to connect on a, a papper powered air purifying respirator or putting the filter on whichever side you want opposite of you using your shoulder fired weapon. The head harness, it's a six point harness. I wanna point out here specifically though on the FM53 and also the FM54 is it uses metal adjustment buckles for durability. Now I'm gonna take the head harness, rotate it up and around the mask and we'll show you the features on the inside. You can notice right here, I've got the nose cup, of course, which allows me to be able to prevent this from fogging up. Now you can see the hydration tube, and I can do that rotation to put it into drinking mode, and then rotating back to stow. If I pull back right here where the chin drip pad is at, you'll see the microphone assembly. It's installed, and this is what allows you to communicate. That microphone assembly picks up your, uh, voice and sound and projects it out to the voice projection unit on the exterior of the mask. Lastly, is I want to talk about the outserts, which you can get. 
They come in a variety of colors. These are ANSI rated, made of a polycarbonate, so it protects the lens of the gas mask from being scratched, and also protects your eyes from any kind of like minor fragmentation that could happen. It's removable with these tabs, so you can swap out colors very easily by inserting the tabs into the side. Trying to do this so you can see it on the camera. So you can swap out from clear lenses to blue blocker lenses to a smoke colored lens based on your lighting conditions. That's a quick overview on the FM53 by Avon. If you have any more questions, give us a call. You can also find us at curtisblueline.com.